Hello! God, I need a haircut. <laughs> as soon as it starts up, I'm like, I can see my hair shooting out the side of my head. Oh, Lord. Hello, and welcome, everybody, to my stream. Hello. Now you can't see me. <laughs> no, I'm not here. This is just a microphone stream. I am not here anymore. <laughs> Hi, how are you guys? Welcome to my stream. Stream, stream. This is my stream song. Song, song. <laughs> Welcome to the stream. King of Afton. Cutie Face. Heaven Rose. Henry Garricky. Welcome to my stream. Hello. Adventures. Adventure! Justin Time Beaver? No. No, no Justin Time Beaver. Please roleplay as Michael Afton. Okay, Heaven Rose. King Afton, aren't you like the king of Afton? Shouldn't you be the one roleplaying? Or is there like more than one Afton? I don't know my FNAF lore. I only know that Afton is in FNAF lore. That's all I got. <laughs> that's, that's all I know. the only one no thanks I'm here to watch most stream I appreciate that I don't know any of the roleplay lore and the such from the FNAF games I've played like all of them but the custom night one and the um I haven't okay I said I've played all of them but but actually there's a few I haven't played I haven't played the custom night I haven't played the VR ones I don't have VR and I haven't played Pizzeria Simulator one? That's not the same one as Custom Night, right? Those are two different games, right? Or am I wrong? I don't remember. <laughs> I think there's a few of them I haven't played now. Is there a Queen Afton as well? That's a very good question. These are questions that need answers. You had your contest today, Heaven. How'd it go? How did it go? You said you had a ton of things you were doing. You had like a duet and a solo maybe a solo a duet and something else maybe as well you had a few things you were doing an ensemble perhaps King Juan Afton what's Michael Afton his daddy I don't think Heaven Rose can be your daddy King Afton I don't look I don't know how, how to, I don't know how to break this to you, but I don't think it's gonna work. <laughs> I don't know, maybe I really don't know anything about FNAF lore, but. I can also just sit here and enjoy my coffee, honestly. This is a coffee kind of... I've been drinking coffee all day. I've gotten so little done, but so much coffee drank. That, that is what happened. That is what has happened today. I've done a little bit of um, editing work. I've done a little recording work for my podcast. Um, new episode coming out tomorrow. Um, but not a lot of work got done today, to be honest. <laughs> just sitting here, sipping my coffee. Who's your daddy? Your solo got 31 points, making it excellent. Duet got 30, and Ensemble got at least over 35, making it superior rating. I say, what's the, what's it out of? Is it like out of 35? Is it out of 40? Like, what what's the maximum possible score? But well done, 31, 30, 35. That sounds awesome. Then. No somniferous in there, hopefully. Not that I can tell. <laughs> Imagine I'm just like two minutes into the stream and I just pass out and then you just see like a masked pig-faced figure come over and steal me away. <laughs> Hallelujah. Hallelujah. But today, we're, we're going to be playing some caramel games. Um... I was, it was getting kind of late, and I hadn't prepared a stream yet. I want to do, like, a, something new. 
on stream, but I don't know what yet. And I was like, okay, let's just throw a stream together real quick, because it was getting late already. And I'm like, all right, let's just do some caramel games. I, I counted how many I have left that I haven't played. Um, and I, oh, actually, I think I may have, I may have still miscounted, but I think it was 31. I, of the ones that I haven't played yet, I believe was 31. Because some of the newest games that would be, like, last on our list to play, I actually have already played because I played them, like, forever ago. Before I was, before I had committed to doing all of them. Kelsey Pop, welcome to the stream! So I think it's 31 we haven't played before, which will be roughly 10 streams because we do about three a stream. So we're getting closer to being um, done with having played with, uh, played all of the Carmel games. King Juan is hugging me now. I don't think so. The only person allowed to hug me is Huggy Wuggy. Hey there, big guy. Hey, big guy. He'll hug you until you pop. Uh, chapter two of that's coming out soon, isn't it? Uh, is there a release date on that yet? I just released a short from my stream today. From from my Poppy Playtime uh, stream. I think 45 is the highest. Superior is highest ranked, then excellent, then good, then fair. Okay. Turbo, welcome to the stream. Your check is just a written order, only you can write that. Check? What check? What check are we talking about? Who's writing me checks? Who's writing me checks? S send me that fat... <laughs> send me that fat bank check, bro. Venmo... Ven, ven, what was it? Venmo me that. I don't have a Venmo. I have a PayPal. <laughs> Highest is 40 points. See, that, that makes sense, because you were saying 35 was superior, and I'm like, well, 35 to 45 would be a pretty big range. 40 sounds, sounds about right. Okay. I am almost there. 31 is a lot of game, but the games are short. Like I was saying, we go through like three of them roughly every time we stream. So we are, we are almost there. Checks in the mail? Is my check in the mail? Who's it from? Who's sending me money? How much? And what do you want in return? Henry, if you're gonna say 45 to 69, you should have said 42 to 69. Get it? Come on, internet. Get your internet culture correct. You got a lot to learn. You got a lot to do. <laughs> I want to look at my properties real quick before I. Yeah, that's what I thought. Boom! I looked over and I saw it trying to white balance me, and I'm like, I don't, I don't want you to do that. Friday Night Funkin' Mods. Um, I don't think so. <laughs> yeah, I don't think we're gonna do that. I, I, I streamed Friday Night Funkin' one time. And it went over really well. But I, I don't really get into doing mods of games and that kind of thing. I don't really get into that. I know like people are like going nuts into the Friday Night Funkin' lore, but I don't know any of it, nor do I care about any of it. So I'm just the wrong guy. I'm just not the right guy to go to for the modding community. I don't mod anything. If there was like, um, which I don't know, I haven't looked at Friday Night Funkin' in a while. If there were any major updates or expansions or whatever to the official game, we'd probably maybe look into that at some point, but I don't really do the modding thing. I don't like Friday Night Funky, Funkin' enough, nor is it a big enough part of this channel for me to be like, let's do all of the mods. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Maybe you don't know what I mean. Maybe you do. You know what I'm saying? Are you picking up what it is that I am putting down? Chandler, welcome to the stream. School rock, it's the schoolhouse rock song. Well, also, checks in the mail is just. Daddy shot the do 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 Daddy shot the do 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 Daddy shot the do 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 Daddy shot 
checks in the mail is just literally a phrase. You, you realize that that was a phrase bef like before Schoolhouse Rock, right? You realize Schoolhouse Rock has not been relevant in American culture in decades, right? <laughs> Hello, Freeman in the ATHF. None of that makes, none of that means anything to me. I don't know who Freeman is, and I don't know what ATHF is. So that is all completely lost on me. Are we gonna do a Roblox anytime soon? I don't know. I have no idea. Sorry, I haven't been talking in Rec Room. I was just eating dinner. I'm not in Rec Room. I haven't played Rec Room in over a year now. <laughs> so that doesn't bother me any. Vince, welcome to the stream. Luis, welcome to the stream. I should probably start my uh, start playing games now. I should do an April Fools video mo. Should I? Is that what I should do? April Fools is like what? This Friday? Yes. I should do one for this Friday. What should I do? What would fool all of you? Should I shave my beard and my head? In my eyebrows, in my eyelashes, <laughs> and just not wear the hat and just be, just be whatever this would be. Is it true that I have an infinite layer of fedoras? This is not true. This is uh, misinformation. I don't know where you've heard that. But um, whoever told you that needs to be removed. I mean, uh, um, corrected uh, in, in their thinking. Like a really short one where you don't have to edit much. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> What are you playing? And that's funny when in one video you play as yourself. I don't know what you're asking me. What am I playing today? We're playing some caramel games. This person is making me, what are they saying? I'm in top chat, I'm not in live chat, so I don't know if there's any messages I'm missing. Let me find out. eyebrows he's gonna shave it right you guys wouldn't even know you would that would be the ultimate april fools no one would even notice you can't even see them <laughs> yeah let's not we're not gonna do any uh afton role play in the chat and let's not make anybody uncomfortable in the chat and then we're cool Uh, King Afton, you can stop saying hi. She has acknowledged your presence already. Okay. You've already gotten a hello. You don't get any more hellos. You're done. <laughs> get to the game. See, the more you ask me to get to the game, the less I want to. So now, now I don't even want to. Now, now it's going to be a... It's gonna be a just chatting stream. All stream, it's gonna be two hours of me just talking about nothing. I don't know if you can hear that. I'm loading up the game now. I'm loading it up, don't worry. I'm loading it up. You played Rollercoaster Deluxe for like 24 hours back in Monday to Tuesday? I did not. 
but I did have the game running on my computer because I notoriously, I've tried to explain this before, I notoriously just leave my computer on and then just walk away. <laughs> so it was running for probably that long, but I wasn't playing it for that long, come on. You hear the music? Do you hear the music? I hear the music. Can you hear the music? I wanted to turn that into like, can you hear the love tonight? But I don't remember the words, so I really can't do much with it. Don't rush, because the longer we wait, the longer he will be live talking to us, and that's entertaining, right? Evan's got the right idea. You don't want me to rush, because then it'll all be over before you know it. The music has some breathing noises, does it? <sighs> Can you hear the breathing? How am I doing today? I'm doing all right. I didn't get nearly as much work done today as I would have liked to, but I'm doing all right. I'm doing okay. Boosh. See if I can um, find, there we go. See if I can find where this needs to go. Right about there. Ha <laughs> ha. Hear the love, you mean feel, yes, that is what I meant. I was trying to turn feel the love into hear the music. Correct, correct. What, what the, the thing that you said is what the thing that I meant. <laughs> can you hear the love tonight? What does that mean? <laughs> you are a pirate. Arr. Um, isn't it supposed to be like talk like a pirate day today? Like literally? Like am I is that true? Did I hear that or was I completely No, that was in September. No, that was in September. I think I was watching like um an old YouTube video or something earlier today. I don't know, maybe I just hallucinated it. September 19th is International Talk Like a Pirate Day, everybody. We need to go back in time and play this in September. And then we will talk like pirates. <laughs> this is, that is the, that is what we're gonna do. All right, everybody have their time machines ready. We're going back in time to September. <laughs> will I do a Roblox stream or a Jackbox stream? Like ever? Probably. In fact, I think, um, depending on how much time we have, uh, by the time we get to the end of this stream, when we're at the end, once we've played our games, um, I'm gonna try to figure out what we're gonna do for the rest of the week and start making a schedule. So if you're around later, we'll, we'll talk about that a little bit. Unless there's nobody around later. Unless I'm just talking to myself and then I'll just do it by myself. Yar, har, fiddle dee, fetch us some grogs. Grogs? Fetch us some, fetch us some grog. Treasure. Treasure, that is what you are, coming from afar. I don't remember what that song is. Who is that by? There's a song, like early to mid 2000s song. Hmm. I think it's, I think it's literally called Treasure. I don't remember who it's by. Will I play Hello Neighbor 2? See, you're asking me all these questions I don't have answers to yet. <laughs> You're asking me, will I play a thing? I probably, I don't know. <laughs> Do I look like I have a plan? <laughs> Hello friends and welcome to Let's Play the Story of Brewster Chiptooth. I'm your host, Magic Man Mo, and this is next on my list of Carmel Games games that we have not yet played, but will soon be playing right now. First things first, we're gonna go to the settings so you guys can make sure you hear their lovely voice acting. It's always the best. And we're gonna hit that play button. Captain Davy, I've decided to leave your crew. I don't wanna be a pirate anymore. I want to give something back to the people. Back to the people, yar! This guy's mustache is coming straight out of his nose. That's not a mustache, that's nose hair. That is some wicked nose hair, my guy. Yar, then be off with you, chip tooth. You're a terrible pirate anyway. What are you planning on doing? Yar. I plan on retrieving Jelly Wrist Logan's treasure from the Forbidden Fort. How do you think Logan got the name Jelly Wrist? <laughs> 
what, what, what is Jelly Wrist? Uh, I'm Jelly Wrist Logan. Does he have like jelly for wrist? Like, is he like notoriously known for not being able to like hold things? Or like a weak? Get your sharks out of here! I don't want to be eating my sharks! Walk the plank, darn you! Does Jellyfish Logan have like a weak, like dead fish handshake or something? What's that all about? There's no treasure inside. It's an old wife's tale. Besides, you're too weak and stupid to open up the fort's door. <laughs> That's not an evil laugh. That's a, not an evil pirate laugh. An evil pirate laugh is. <laughs> I think that's I think that that's a better pirate laugh, right? Because you gotta get like ah, yeah, <laughs> right. That's a better laugh than his, right? Rate us. Who's the better? Who who wore the better pirate laugh? Me or him? You tell me. All right, that's it. Okay, we gotta open a magical pirate door by being smart if and strong. Only I could just, just conjure a spell. Kapow! Hocus hocus hocus. That one doesn't come up often, but when it does, <laughs> can we talk to the bird? Polly want a cracker? Do you? Do you want a cracker? Also, what, how's the volume? Is it too loud when they talk? Is it okay? I am a high class bird. I don't eat regular crackers. I prefer organic pumpernickel and rye crackers. Actually, same. Not not as like I, I don't eat a lot of crackers, but I. If you're talking about bread, pumpernickel and rye is where it's at, my guys. Volume is a little loud. We can fix that. We can fix that. Right, splickety split. Is the voices too loud, or is the like all of it too loud? Oh, and with something on it that will make my taste buds explode. Pow! Exploding taste buds. I'll see what I can find. We need to find some fancy crackers for Polly. And something on it. Like some fancy cheese. I'm gonna put some squeeze cheese on those rye crackers. Is volume better? Is volume better or should I turn the music volume down too? I'm gonna wait to get some kind of confirmation on this. The volume is better. Is that better? Okay, I'll take it. Just joined, what's the game? Derek, and welcome to the stream. We're playing some caramel games today. We'll be playing three of them. The first one we're playing today is the story of Brewster Chiptooth. All the links, by the way, all the links to the games I'm playing are in the description down below. In case you want to play these or whatever on your own. <laughs> That's what Jeffy shoved in his diaper when we first met him, the squeeze cheese. Is that the freaking? I think I, I think I know who you're talking about, but I don't remember anyone shoving. No, wait, no, I'm thinking, no, I'm thinking of a, a completely different character. Who's Jeffy? Who is Jeffy? I don't remember a Jeffy. Nice on the music. Excellent. Excellent. All right, let's talk to these guys, see if they have anything else to Ahoy, offer me. Ahoy, Captain Jack. Ahoy, Captain Jack. Yar. Yar. Hello. Want to read the boat for the day? It cost one doubloon. I need a doubloon for that boat. I don't know why I need the boat, but I want that boat. I don't have a doubloon. We need to go get some doubloons. They know a boat for you. Next. You don't need to yell next when there's literally no one here. Unless you think Polly is going to rent a boat. Oh, can I take the ladder? That's Captain Davy Chumbucket's ship. I'm no longer a part of his crew. I, he said Captain Davy Chumbucket, but his name apparently is Cham Bucket. But I like Chum Bucket. I like to think that he's just like Plankton's like uh, human human counterpart of some kind from SpongeBob or something. That's Captain Davy Chum Bucket. All right, all right. That's Captain Davy. All right. Ahoy, Captain Davy. Captain Davy. Arg! I'm not in the mood for chit chat, Chip Tooth. Chit chat, Chip Tooth. I love that. That was good. I'm all out of rum. <gasps> Why is the rum gone? Why is the rum always gone? Why is the rum gone? We need to maybe maybe we can get him some rum and maybe he'll give us something. Also, are we really Chip Tooth? We're more like Gap Tooth. We got a gap in our teeth. We don't have chipped teeth, as far as I can tell. Can I go to the left? No, but I can go to the right. 
to the village. Let's go to the village and see what the village has to offer us. Oh, we got we got cove crafts for the discerning artist. We got Barnacle Bay Boutique. Ah, I like the triple B. And we've got the Grand Cannon. I get it, I get it, I get it. Let's talk to this guy. Ahoy! Would Sir care to purchase some wooden legs? Sure. One never knows when an accident might befall one. We offer several ergonomically designed prosthetics for the discerning customer. You can't say discerning. Covecrafts has the word discerning. They look like table legs with bits added for decoration. Actually, yeah, they do. I hadn't really, I hadn't really looked at them that closely. I guess I'm not very discerning. I can assure you, sir, that these have been lovingly crafted by master craftsmen. Uh-huh. Yeah, sure. Whatever. How much does it cost? One doubloon. We have a special sale. <laughs> Buy one and get two more for free. And it only costs one doubloon. Really? All right. I don't have a doubloon. I still don't have that darn doubloon. Oh, that's a shame. You don't want to miss this once-in-a-lifetime sale. Find a way to get a doubloon and hurry back. I will, I will do that. I will find a way to get a doubloon. Also, is this a piece of a map? Ooh, it is. I've got I one still out of don't three. have all the map pieces. You guys can't see it because I'm, like, in the way, but I've got one out of three map pieces. Ahoy! Yar! Welcome to Cove Crafts. We have a vast selection of brushes, canvases, and paint. Excellent. Can I have all of it for a single doubloon? I don't know if I need any of those. I hardly know how to draw a line. Okay, drawing a line is pretty straightforward. Yeah, get it straight and forward and line. Just take, take a pen and just whoop, line. Of course you do. Let your inner pirate express himself. Do you have a doubloon? Oh, I wish I had a doubloon. All the things I could do with but a single doubloon. I don't have any money. Then your inner pirate will have to find a different way of expressing himself. <laughs> oh no, my inner pirate can't express himself. All right, we really need that doubloon. Is, are there any more items I can grab before I try to, there's a bucket. Any more items I can try to acquire before I either go th through the tunnel or into the Grand Cannon? Let's go into the Grand Cannon. Rum! An empty bottle of rum. Oh, it's empty, Oh, sad day. There's like a cupcake over here? What's that? It's cream tea. It smells so terrible I placed it by the window. Does that make it smell less terrible? Can I have it? And can I put it in my pocket? Yes, take it. I'm gonna put your smelly cheese in my pocket. Yes, where it belongs. In my pants. Can I use the uh, pho phone booth? I can. No need to pay if you're a pirate. I don't know if that's how phone booths work. One, two, three, four. Daddy no! Pirate sharks are my weakness. At least it's not like alligators or something, right? Like like Captain Hook style. We need to have an alligator song. A crocodile. Was he an alligator or a crocodile? I think it was a crocodile. Alligator? You know the one I'm talking about. The Peter Pan alligator guy with the clock in his belly. The crocodile. <laughs> Has anyone ever done that? Has anyone ever called it a, a clocodile? If not, that's amazing. Hey cow, welcome to the stream. Got the cheese touch? What's the cheese touch? At least a mouse would love it? Perhaps. Perhaps there is a mouse. Let's see, I've got a sign over here. Ooh. Oh, oh, there was a map piece. Oh, I, I, I was just trying to read that. I guess there was a map piece in there. All right. Can I take any of your cups? What kind of drinks can I buy here? Rum? It's a pirate bar. All we have is rum. Five doubloons for a bottle. Five doubloons? Well, I need five doubloons. Is it possible to buy half a bottle or just a cup of rum? Just a cup. Just a cup of rum. That's not... 
how you drink rum. I mean, you, yeah, I guess you do in a glass, but not like. Okay, you know what? Never mind. It's fine. You're a pirate. Drink rum however you want to drink it. No. Usually, you don't just drink rum out of the bottle either, but we are pirates. Ooh. There's a lump in the carpet. <gasps> it's a doubloon! I found a doubloon! I found a doubloon! I need four more doubloons. Get a bottle of rum. Yo, ho, ho! Find a bottle Ahoy, of rum. matey. Ahoy. Yar! 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 <laughs> Are we having a yar off right now? Yar sale, everybody's welcome. Uh, is there any more doubloons hidden in the floor? Not that I see. All right, I'll come back. Are there gonna be hidden doubloons? I need to keep an eyeball out for hidden doubloons. Oh. Is there a rum vending machine? Now, so there's a sign up here for service or refund. Please call 555 R. That's it. That, okay, we, that's the number we'll have to call for servicing on this. A rum vending machine. A can of rum for one doubloon. A can? Can rum? All right. I, I gotta see this. Do they make canned rum? And I've just never heard of this. Y oh, God. Y Yuri Ranilla. There we go. Got, you. Got it. Welcome to the stream. Apparently people have called them crocodiles before. That's amazing. I've never heard it before. I was just like, wait a minute, genius right now. These are the graves and skeletons of those who tried to enter the forbidden fort. Oh, what happens when you try to enter the forbidden fort? I mean, besides dying, like how did these people die? It looks like there's a tunnel trying to get underneath. Also, this guy's just drinking bottle an endless of rum. bottle. Ugh. Mr. Skeleton has a good grip. I can't get the bottle from his hand. Really? Really? It's an infinite bottle. Can I use the cheese as like a grease? It doesn't work. Ah, maybe it would. Can I slip the empty bottle in I there? I can't collect much rum that way. Well, it does seem to be endlessly pouring, so maybe I could. All right, fine. This is the door to the Forbidden Fort. If I try to open it with an axe or any other weapon, I'll end up like Boney there. How so? Do like bullets come shooting out of these little holes in the door that you guys probably can't really see because of the chat being in the way, but like what happens? How do these people die? Is it cursed? What's down here? Tom oh. Cutlass Rattler Trips? What are you doing here? Cutlass Rattler. Is he trying to get into the Forbidden Fort? Also, he has just a portrait of himself. I'm too depressed to face the world. Ever since my lovable parrot disappeared, my life is ruined. Oh, why me? Come back, Roxy. Come back. Do you just live down here? I thought this was like a tunnel to get into the fort. Also, I was not expecting to f see a depressed pirate when we started this adventure, but here we are. All I have is this pirate that keeps me company. Pirate? Okay, all right, okay, I'll take it. I like it, it, you try, it was a stretch, but anything you can do to get a pirate pun in there, I'll appreciate. Can I get this, uh, there's a third piece of map over here. I have all the map pieces. Indeed I do, can I look at, oh my god, it's one of these. Is it just like click, oh, oh it's a, ro oh, it, you just rotate it. Oh, that's not so bad, I think. Oh, this will be easy, right? Right? I'm not completely I'm not completely dumb, right? I'm actually not sure how this I'm not sure how this one actually Oh, wait, I did I do. Ah, there it is. I was about to say I actually don't know how that one connects, but This isn't even a puzzle. <laughs> this isn't even a puzzle. This is just to pad out your time in the game. Beautiful. Oops, I think that one was actually already fine. Whoops. I get a little click happy, I just start clicking. Oopsie. Blam! Now I can sail to Thagoras Island. Thagoras! Thagoras. Now I can sail- Okay, fantastic. I need a boat, though. Ooh, what's this guy got? He's got a little doubloon in his medallion! There was a delicious oh. pumpernickel rye cracker inside the necklace. It's not a doubloon, it's even better! It's a cracker! 
Can I take his eye patch? <gasps> we got the balloon in his eye! A pearl! No, it's it's even better. It's a pearl. <laughs> I'm very excited to find a doubloon. It's not a doubloon. It's a pearl. Can I take the pie rat? That's Tom's rat. It's not a rat. It's a pie rat. Yeah, I heard you the first time. Can I open your drawers? Tom? Oh, why did Roxy have to go? Why? It's a cruel, cruel world. <laughs> It's the circle of life, my friend. It's the circle of life. Look, I'm gonna go try to find you an even better uh, parrot named Polly with my with my rye cracker. First, we're gonna actually make a phone call because I'm very curious to see what happens with that. Five, 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 A, R, G, H. Arr. Pirate Conroy Vending Incorporated, may I help you? You may. I have a broken vending machine I'd like you to take a look at. Um, you have a vending machine outside the fort? That is correct. Is there a problem? Nope. What do you mean, nope? So goodbye! Oh, do I have to make a problem? Do I have to go make a problem with that vending machine? Do I have to go invent a problem? Can I put my doubloon in it? Nothing happened. Where's my rum? Yeah, where's my rum? The machine stole my doubloon. Okay, now we have a problem. Now we have a problem. Here we go. <laughs> Call the number again. Five, 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 A, R, G. It took a lot longer to call Pirate phone Conroy numbers back here. Incorporated, may I help you? Did they even have technology, have this technology at this era? Um, I don't know where I was when you made that comment, but they did not have payphone technology in pirate days. They did not. Not, at least, at least not like this. I don't think. I don't think so. I don't think they had any phones yet. He said goodbye. Goodbye! Pack Wolf, welcome to the welcome stream. Welcome to the stream. Pack Wolf Gaming, member of the channel. That's the one. I paid for a can of rum in your vending machine and didn't get anything. Where and when was that? Just now, outside the fort. Right now, outside the fort. That's what I said. Oh yeah, that vending machine is all messed up. Talk to the bartender and tell him Ken sent you. He'll give you your money back along with some compensation. So you know it's broken. So when I called earlier about the machine, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, when I called earlier, you were like, is there something wrong with it? You already knew that there was something wrong with it. Let's just get that straight right now. The password is, give me back my money, you dirty pirate. Do I have to say it in literally a completely different voice? Like you did, like, the password is, give me back my money, you dirty pirate. Like, literally, it sounded like two different people talking. Thanks. All right. I had some trouble with the vending machine, and the guy on the phone told me to tell you that Ken sent me. Yar, I see. Did he say anything else? He did. Give me back my money, you dirty pirate. Here is one doubloon instead of the one you lost in the machine, and here's another one as compensation for your bad experience. Ooh, I doubled my money. Thanks. Now what if I go do it again? <laughs> what if I go to the vending machine, put another doubloon in it, call up Ken, and he's like, all right, here's what you gotta do. And then I go over to the bartender and I do the whole thing again, I get another two, so now I have three. And then I do it again, and I go back down to two, but then I go up to four, and then I do it again, I go down to three, and then I do it again, I got five. Bottle of rum. Uh, I don't know if the, if the game's gonna let me do that or not. I can't actually even click on this anymore at all. Oop, I've completely clicked off the game. Hi, everybody. There we go. Can I go, can I go stick a coin back in here? No way. I don't trust this machine anymore. But infinite money hacks! The machine- All right, fine. All right, fine. I have two doubloons. I also have a cracker. I don't know if I need to get one of these things, like, first. How about you? I have one doubloon right here. Let me get some table legs. I don't know why. Splendid. Here are your new legs. Excellent. Thanks. Okay, you guys can't see this, but one of them 
is, <laughs> is a leg. Like someone's actual foot. I got two table legs and an actual foot. I was just expecting to get the three legs on the table there, not someone's severed freaking leg. Enjoy your new peg leg. Peg leg deluxe and the Simon peg leg. Simon peg leg? Who's Simon? Can I bring him his leg pet back? Also, why did you spell it with two G's? For peg and leg. This peg leg smells like alcohol. I think it was soaked in it. Was he pickling his leg in alcohol? No refunds. Oh, I don't want a refund because it smells like alcohol, I assure you. All right, am I supposed to do something with this? Here, let me give my doubloon to my cove crab. I have one doubloon right here. Oh, I understand, Pack Wolf. I hope things are settling down a little bit. I I, I absolutely understand when uh, life starts getting busy. He just robbed the dead in the cemetery. Oh, probably. Yeah, I think you might be onto something there. Great. Each color costs one to blue. Which color would you prefer? Uh, red. Excellent choice. Here you go. I don't know why I need any colors at all, but there you go. All right, now that we've, we've completely spent all my money on crap instead of the, the boat ride, let's give Polly a cracker. I've got something for you. Oh, please. Like, I'm going to put that thing in my mouth. Oh, I gotta put cheese on it! But it's an organic pumpernickel and rye cracker. I forgot about the cheese, the smelly cheese! Yes, but I want something on top of it. I'm on it. Cheese! Ah, now I have a cheesy cracker! I've got something for you. Oh, that looks splendid. And it smells even better. And there are plenty more where that came from. If you just come with me, let me paint you red, and then you'll look like Tom's parrot. I think I'll join you in your quest, if I may. Oh, but you may. Wise decision. Excellent. Now we're going to take my paint that I've acquired that you guys can't see and put on my green parrot. Red parrot! We done it. We done it. All right, Tom, prepare to meet your long dead parrot, or at least a facsimile of it. Tom, I think I found your parrot. I think I did. Roxy, is that you? Yeah, it's do totally it Roxy. Is. Oh, such a glorious day. Glorious day indeed. You can have my pirate in exchange. I don't want it. <laughs> Thanks. Are you just on the, what? what? The evil vulture stole my pirate! Where did the vulture come from? I'm underground! And it came from the top right! Was there just a vulture in here? Can I beat him with Simon's peg leg? Here, take the Simon peg leg! Oh my god, it's working. Gold. Just pure gold. Excellent. I have a pirate. I don't know why. I have nothing to say to him. Okay, fine. Be that way then. I hope... I don't, I never knew the parrot's name. It wasn't Roxy, I don't think. But, um... Good luck with, with all that you do. Can I fill up my alcohol peg leg with this? It doesn't work. Or the deluxe? It doesn't work. Or the rat? It doesn't work. Fine, that's fair. That's fair enough, honestly. Um, These are the grave... Can I do something with the grave stuff? Can I put the rat in the door? It doesn't work. Can I put the peg legs in the door? It doesn't work. Can I put the peg legs together? It doesn't work. Can I put the pearl in the door? I put a pearl in the door. I don't know why I did that, but I put a pearl in the door. It doesn't work. I think I need a second pearl. Have we seen a pearl anywhere or another hidden doubloon? Can I put the pirate on the ship? It doesn't work. I don't think. Now I can. I think giving him an empty bottle will only make him more angry. Yeah, I need to 
fill the rum bottle. Can I use one of these legs as like a funnel? Can I, I have a pie rat, but I don't have any pie. I don't think he'd want that. I don't think anybody wants that, to be honest. Was there another direction I can go down here? I don't think he'd want that. There. I don't think... Doesn't... See, I've got one that's called alcohol peg leg. It doesn't... I can't collect much rum that way. This makes me think I need to do something with this. He just grabbed the parrot and put it in red paint. Yes, I literally... Just put the parrot in paint. You need a rag. I need a rag? I need a rag from the bar? Oh, there is a rag. May I take this rag? I didn't even see that I could click on that. There is a rag. I, I didn't even realize I could take it. Yeah, why not? Thank you, sir. Thank you. Am I gonna go soak up the rum? Is that what I'm gonna go do? The rag is soaked with rum. I feel like this is even less efficient than just taking the rum bottle and just shoving it in there, but you know what? I'll take what I can get. I filled the bottle with rum. Yo ho ho in a bottle of rum for me. Okay, now if I give this to you. I brought you a bottle of rum. Of, of rag rum taken from the dead lips of a former trespasser, yes. For me? Very good, Chip Tooth. Here's something in return. Is it a doubloon? It is! It's a doubloon! I have one doubloon right here. Excellent! Your take this oar with you. The boat is yours until sundown. You can't you can't just pretend he didn't just say your instead of yar. Your! You meant yar. Yar. Thanks. I've got an oar. Is there anything else I need to do in town before I leave? I don't think so. Let's go for it. <laughs> Who are you, and what are you wearing? Are you are you a native of this teeny tiny island? There's a hole in this tree trunk. There sure is. A campfire. Uh huh. Can we talk to this guy? Hello, Thagoras. Oh, that's Thagoras. Okay, I'm here for your treasure. Hello, and welcome to my cannibal island. Oh. Lucky for you, I have a pie here waiting to be eaten by me. So I won't have you for lunch. I didn't realize this was a cannibal island. Is it a meat pie? That's great news. Yes. Now stop bothering me while I wait for my cannibal friends. How big is this island? It looks like a small island. I'm going to send the pie rat to eat your pie. That's an interesting idea. But if you'll see the rat, it won't be good. I'll paint the rat red. Oh, do I need to go back and like exchange the paint for like green paint so he'll be a camouflaged rat? Though it's made of wood, it won't burn that well. Okay, how about the alcohol peg leg? I have a torch. I put the alcohol peg leg in the fire, and now I have a torch. I don't know why I've done this. It doesn't work. I can put the rat in the hole. I can put the rat in the hole. Oh. Sure, I'll pick up that half-eaten pie. A pearl. It has a pearl in it. Oh. Okay, I think I'm done here. Bye. I gotta get out of here before he realizes his pie has been et. Got eated. I'm gonna go put this pearl inside this. Oh, oh, oh. Can I put this deluxe peg into the hole? Oh, I can. I'm going. The tunnel in. leading inside the fort is too dark to walk through without a light. I have a light. Now I can walk through this dark tunnel. Yes. Oh, well, this wasn't a dark tunnel at all. What's this? Ah. Oh, it's tiny. The squares are so small. I can't even see the screen. All right. Uh, we gotta figure out. 
Oh, Lord. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, dear me. Oh, no. Oh, my. Oh, goodness. I think the white lines need to go around the outside. I sure hope that's true because we're gonna be in for something of what we might call a doozy if that's not true. You know what I'm saying? I wanna try to do that first. I'm gonna try to get all of these things, all of the white lines all around the outside lined up first. That's very classic puzzle strategery right there is to get all of your outside pieces first and then work your way inside I inside I don't know who invented this strategy but they were a smart cookie they was all right so now we've got the corners where they need to be so the rest in the middle is just kind of needs to be like kind of sorted out you know yeah that looks I guess about right uh, that ain't not right. Does, does, doesn't this look like it kind of doesn't match? Maybe it's fine. Yeah, I guess it has to be fine. Yeah. Some, something like that? I'm not really getting a good sense of what... There's a ship in here somehow. I can see pieces of ship. I just don't know how it all adds up yet. But we... we we shall soon see, I suppose. Yas. Oh, yas. Oh, indeed. Oh, yas. These things line up somehow. There we go. I think it's a ship that's been, like, marooned on an island or something. Let's get the tops here figured out. Yeah. No. Is that? What am I looking at over here? What? I don't understand you what I'm looking at there yet, but we'll we'll get there. We'll get there. I'm gonna slide that over there. This looks like some of the ground that goes around here somewhere. Yes. Oh my God! What a frick! What even? What? Is that is that correct? Doesn't that look like a different shade of green? I don't see anything else that would make any more sense, so I guess we're going with it. Um, I, I think this... Probably right there-ish. Yes. Oh, this is maybe it? Yeah, there we go. We've got this kind of like pie thing going on here. I don't, look, I know what I meant. I said I know I said pie, and I know that makes probably zero sense. So just go with it. That looks right. What the frick? Okay, this is part of the moon. The moon! The moon! All hail the moon! Yeah, there's like a ship or something over here. Tyler, hey, welcome to the stream. The moon! The moon! There's another piece of shit. There it is. There's another piece of ship over here somewhere. A piece of ship. Pa. 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 Ah! The moon! It's like it's trees on an island. I'm still not sure what I'm looking at here. This is a part of the sky. Yes. A piece of this tree over here. It's like a nighttime scene. It would probably be helpful if it's a little bit brighter too, for me to see it a little bit better. And if you thought for a second that I wasn't gonna sit here and complain about this puzzle, you thought wrong. Ah, there we go. 
That right. I love how that went. Ah, there we go. Yes. Oh, it's a, it's a skull. It's a giant skull. Oh, I see. I think these two need a switch. There we go. It's a giant pot of gold! I cool. got it! Jelly Wrist Logan's treasure is mine now! Jelly Wrist Logan! Now it's time to fix the bad reputation us pirates have. I don't know if you're gonna do that. Also, it's bad reputation we pirates have. Thank you very much. We can start by doing better grammar. <laughs> Hey, and we did the, the game, and we did the success, we did the money, pirate rich, now we can have all the rum. That is a lot of doubloons for rum. Forget the museum thing he's doing, we can buy some rum. God, that one took me a while to beat, that one took a while. That ship is a call out for one of the game with a female pirate. Yeah, Captain Marcella. You talking about Captain Marcella? We've done we've done a couple of her games, a couple of a couple of Captain Marcella games, and that was the story of Brewster Chiptooth. Oddly enough, we actually have played um, one of the games where he's doing his uh, museum thing, but a long time ago, like literally a couple years ago now, I think, when we first started learning about Carmel games, and I didn't know we would be playing a, a bunch of these yet. I think I did um, one or two of his games already. One of the newer ones. Do, 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 do. I'm loading up the next one. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. Blam. I gotta, I gotta get this lined up. Something like that. Next up on our list, if you couldn't tell, it's Crazy Mom. Alright. One down, two to go, everybody. I hope you're strapped in. Are you strapped in? Because <laughs> we're about to go. Should we take a quick break, actually, to grab snacks? You guys need us to grab snacks and a drink? <sighs> I think I'm going to go refill my coffee. And I'll BRB. So don't go too far. I want to go grab my coffee. While you guys wait, if you don't have any snacks or drinks to pick up for yourself... Consider hitting that like button. I'll be right back.
do 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 All right, I'm back. <clears throat> Are you guys back? Hello, friends, and welcome to Let's Play Crazy Mom. I'm your host, Magic Man Mo, and this is the next in my list of Carmel Games games that we're playing that I haven't played yet before. Let us continue by uh, hitting the old settings button, upping the volume of the beautiful voice acting that we love to listen to, and hitting the play button. Today is mine and Crazy Dad's 15th anniversary, and I'm throwing a party. But oh dear, some of the items I need for the party are missing. Could they not get... Could they not get... Like... A woman to play the voice acting? That is clear... That is just... A guy's voice that has been tuned up. <laughs> that has been pitched up. Pitch, I think, is what I meant to say. It's clear... I think... I'm pretty sure that's just... One of the regular dudes with a pitched up voice. Oh my gosh, that's hilarious. Sons, welcome to the stream. Hola, bienvenidos. I need to get balloons. I need to find good music for the party. And last but not least, I must get drink stirs. I can't serve cocktails without them. Ah, you'll be fine. Just get some spoons. Good music. Balloons. Drink stirs. Got it. Happy anniversary. It's 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 crazy mom and crazy dad's anniversary. The cocktails for the party. But they're no good without drink stirs. I have to buy some. Oh, your eyes just always like that. It was a giant cake. Oh. I make crazy dad's favorite cake, especially for the party. I can't eat it before the party starts. Okay. I'm just seeing if there's any items I can get. There's a little mouse hole. It's locked. <laughs> it's locked! Do I need a little mouse key? What's this little tape? I can use this duct tape to attach balloons to the cabinet. I better get balloons. Oh, okay. Is that what that's for? All right. Nothing in here. What's this? Doesn't it look like there's a plank of wood here or something? Why can I open that if there's nothing there? I can use this duct tape to attach balloons to the cabinet. I better... Okay, okay. Nothing in here. Oh. Do you keep anything in your cabinets? Oh, a key! <gasps> Does it go to the mouse hut? <laughs> It's got a dollar in it! My secret wall dollar! <laughs> Alright, I've got some money. Alright. Crazy Dad's cassette player. Ooh. But it's no good without our wedding song. Ah, oh, we gotta get our wedding song on cassette. Where do we keep our wedding song? Why do I get the feeling we have to leave our house and find our cassette somewhere in town? Alright, let's go do that. Oh, I can go to a number of places. We can go to downtown, home sweet home, the library park or museum of nature. Let's go downtown first. Downtown! Gluten-free fruits! I'm pretty sure all fruits are gluten-free. I'm, I'm pretty I'm pretty sure about that one. Somehow the items at the bottom always turn out to be very handy. I need to find a way to get whatever's down there. Oh, that's true. We need to get, there's probably a coin or something down there. Hello, do you sell fruit that looks like balloons? Um, why? Of course. You can buy watermelons, cantaloupes, or oranges. They all look like balloons. I mean, I guess a bit of a stretch, but sure. I'll take an orange. Okay. How much money do you have? Okay, now, is this a... Are you sticking me up? Is this a muggery that's happening right now? Enough to buy an orange. Yes, yeah, clearly. Thank you, Crazy Mom. Here's your orange. I guess I did. I guess I did have enough money to buy an orange. Hey, this orange is all rotten and sticky. It is. It's got like mold on it or something. It looks kind of like, I don't know. No refunds. What do you mean no refunds? I am, I am un, unsatisfied with the quality of your orange. Hello, do you sell drink stirs? He sells candy. I sell everything you need to throw a party, except for drink stirs, balloons, and party music. Those are you can buy cupcakes or candy. Everyone loves candy. But I need the three things you don't sell. Yes, Crazy Dad sure loves candy. Show me the candy. <laughs> Show me the candy. Show me the money. I have money. Here you go. Thank you, Crazy Mom. Here are your strawberry lollipops. I didn't ask for any, but look, I have a singular strawberry lollipop. Excellent. 
Uh, what am I gonna do with it? I don't know. Can we go digging through the trash? There's a sick infected fly hovering over the trash. I don't want to catch it. Besides, we have enough snacks for the party. I don't think we're looking through the trash for snacks. There's a... How about the orange? That rotten orange should be placed in the trash. Yeah, we're throwing it away, and maybe the fly will die. Oops. <laughs> Oops. The fly is glued to the rotten, sticky orange. Excellent. I guess now we can take the trash. A hammer. There's a hammer in the trash. There is a hammer in the trash. All right. Can we hammer our way down here? It doesn't work. Well, if you try hard enough, it just might. It does. Um, what else we got going on around here? I think we can just leave. We'll leave. Um, home sweet home is our home sweet home, right? Yes. Let's leave. Let's go to the little berry. Oh, hello there. Hello. Hi. Shh. Shh. Sorry. I'm not sorry. Shh. Mmm. Mmm. She's got balloons. Balloons. May I borrow them? Heavens no. These balloons are for Agnes's retirement party. Screw Agnes. Actually, my grandma's name is Agnes. <laughs> is it my grandma's retirement party? She's been retired for a while. All right, no further explanation on that one. All right, fine. Hello. Shh. What's, um, oh, what's this? There's like a amulet up here. A necklace. Or a necklace, whatever you want to call it. Can I trade you this? I don't think she wants that. I think she might. It was pr a pretty looking I necklace. I don't have time to read books right now. Oh, there's always time to read books. Up at the computer. Ooh, puzzle? Uh, Tetris? Oh, I can click and drag. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. It is. It's basically Tetris. Oh, oh, there's pieces. There's pieces underneath pieces. This is, okay. This is a little annoying to look at, isn't it? Let's see if we can figure out how these go together. That doesn't really snap. Why do I get the feeling that, like, this will literally just snap in place if I find the right one? Or maybe it just feels like it snap. Oh, maybe. Oh. Okay. It's not it kind of, it's snapping when you bring it outside of the range or something. Okay, fine. Let's just put this up here for now. And you right there for now. We gotta get a we gotta get a good sense and grasp of what pieces I even have to begin with. And then we'll figure it out from there. Oh, this blue one doesn't move. Oh, this blue one doesn't move. How about this red one? Oh, those don't move. Some of these don't move. And neither does the yellow. Uh Okay, that's gonna help. All right, that's gonna help me figure it out. Okay, so these three in the middle do not move. I see. All right, well, let's work with that from here. Let's just stick that there for now. That can go there. That's too tall, which inherently kind of brings us to an immediate problem already. But I, I, I can just do, I can do, I don't know, that. Mm, that's not gonna, so that's not gonna fly. Can I rotate? No. I think I can probably bring this down and something can go, yeah, like that, right? And then I'm not sure from there, but I got, I've got two tickets to paradise. There we go. Look at this. I'm a god. Da I'm a god dang genius. I'm a freak of nature. The computer broke again. I better call the technician. I hacked into the mainframe and broke your computer. Now hand over your balloons. Okay, she's just gone. Yoink. Balloons. Take them. Balloons. I know. D take them. Balloons. Do I need scissors to cut them down? It doesn't work. Maybe I need scissors to it cut them down. I need to go get some schizors, perhaps. Is there anything else in here that I can take? How about this wood? This shelf might come in handy. I'll take it. I'll just put that in my pocket? In my dress, as it were? I don't seem to have pockets. There are some dresses that have pockets. But I get the sneaking suspicion that mine does not. I'm just saying. All right, let's leave and get out of here.
Mo legit thinks he's being scammed right now. <laughs> I am. The wall has money because it's a wallet. Oh, that's hilarious. That's hilarious. Let's go to the park. We need to find some schizors. Oh, there's a frog. He's not a schizor, but he's a frog. It's a frog. Yeah, can I get you with the lollipop? It doesn't work. Maybe frogs like lollipops. I don't know. Crazy park. Crazy park. All right, what else do we got? Anything? Just the frog? Anything else I can do here? No need to go in the pond. I already had a bath. Besides, it will ruin my shoes. Can I put, can I put the shelf in the... Okay, we've made a bridge. I think it's safe to cross the pond now. I wasn't gonna try to, but can I take the frog? It's a frog. It is. Can I take and I... Do I hammer the frog? It doesn't work. Fine. It doesn't... I can get to the frog. I've got nothing to give the frog. Oh, I need that fly! From downtown. Can I get the fly? The fly is glued to the sticky orange. I'll take it. Boom! But we were, we refused to dig through the trash because the fly was in the trash. Now I'm just going to pick up the fly? You know why that's crazy, right? You know why that makes no sense, right? It's not just me, right? Fine, all right, let's go get the frog. Mr. Frog will surely love this. Uh-huh. Mr. Frog gave me a hook. He what now? <laughs> He gave me a hook. I thought we were gonna keep the frog. Can I put the hook on the necklace and make like a hook and necklace thing? No? All right. I think the hook is gonna help us get into the sewer grate from downtown. I think. All right, let's just leave. I think that's all I can do here. Before we try to figure that out, let's go to the Museum of Nature. What is this three-eyed thing? What is this? Why does it look like he's got a bean on his head? All right, fine. It's a stuffed snake. Oh, I thought it was like an eel of some kind, but sure. I think it's one of Crazy Dad's relatives. You calling Crazy Dad a mammoth? Does that even make sense? Hello, sir. I'm here to explore and learn. Oh, he's got skizzers. Knock yourself out. Now, please don't bother me. My job is to guard this museum, not to chit-chat with its wacky guests. And yet you find yourself chit-chatting with me anyway. How rude. Can I have your scissors? May I borrow those scissors? Please. No. Please. I'm gonna hammer you. I don't think he'd want that. Oh, it doesn't matter if he wants that. <laughs> oh, the necklace. Can I bribe him with the I necklace? I don't think he'd want that. I don't know, maybe. What, does he want a lollipop? I don't think he'd want lollipop, that. Lollipop, lollipop. Ooh, lolly, 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 lollipop. Ba -dum -bum -bum. I think it's... You know, y'all know what I'm talking about. What are you planning on doing with this hammer? Breaking the snake free? That's what I plan on doing. Unless you want to stop me. Me? Nothing at all. It doesn't... What are you plan... Me? Okay, okay, alright. Does... I gotta hammer the snake for some reason. I don't know why. Let me come back to this. Can I use the hook here? That's no good. The hook is not big enough to catch the items at the bottom. Yeah, I think I need to be able to lo like lower it down, right? I think. What do I gotta do with the lollipop? Have we discovered... Is there something else I need to do that I've like forgotten about? Can I use the lollipop as a stirrer? Great stirrer's problem solved. I'm so creative. Oh! I am so creative. Oh, I just, I was just like, can I do that? And it freaking worked! Heck yeah. All right. Is there anything else I can do in here? Obviously, I still need balloons. And, of course, music. Have we even seen where we can get music from? Maybe it's at the bottom down here. I don't see anything else to do there. I don't have the skizzers for the balloons. I can't read I don't have the books. Is there something I'm supposed to do with the books? Uh, I don't think there's anything to do here. I think... I think it's safe. 
All right, I think the only thing I got left to do is in the Museum of Nature. Can I give you money? Bribe you? I have no reason to do that. What do you mean, no reason? That means that there must be a reason. Hello, sir, I'm... Knock yourself out. Now please don't bother me. My job... How... Can I bribe him? Can I put on the skizzers? It doesn't work. It does it does. It. Hmm. I must be missing something, right? I have a pet flamingo hatching out of its egg right now. Mo, will you help me name him? Or her? Pet flamingo hatching right now? Um. Well, it's gotta start with an F, right? For flamingo, how about like, like it could be Frankie or Francine, uh, 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 or even Philip, even though it's like a ph, but you know, it has the right sound, or like a Phyllis, my mom's name is Phyllis, um, a Freddy. We need to know, is this a boy name or a girl name? Or do we need to find like a, a good androgynous name? You could, you could call the flamingo Fern. Fern the flamingo. Yeah? Fantastic flamingo Fern. I'm working on it, I'm trying. Maybe frogs like lollipops. I don't know. <laughs> 2022. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. What about Francesco? Or Francesca? Francesca. Fern is actually kind of cute. I think Fern is kind of a good name. It's like not really a name, but like kind of works, right? Little fur in the flamingo. I'm just saying. I think, hey, Cal. Uh, it was five minutes ago. Maybe you're up to speed. For some reason, I think you're behind in the chat. Like, I think you're. Uh, live stream might have like lagged back a little bit you might need a refresh i think you're a minute or two behind i'm not sure i could be wrong i could be wrong uh, what am i what are you planning on me hmm. it does. It does. i don't it. know what to do with the necklace and i need those skizzers how about i think it's is there, is there something I can do with the mammoth? It does. It does. It. It does. Hmm. Hello, sir. Knock yourself out. Now please don't bother me. My job is to guard this museum. How rude. May I bar No. It's not giving me much to work with. Yeah, I don't know how one tells, like, the gender of a fur, of a fur, and of a flamingo. She literally said the mammoth looks like one of Crazy Dad's relatives. She did, she did say that. I think it's one of Crazy Dad's relatives. She doesn't even say that she thinks it looks like. She says she thinks it is one of his, one of his relatives. Wish I could, I wish there could be pictures in the chat so we could see the flamingo. Oh yeah, we could have pictures of cute baby flamingo fern in our chat, Oh, Is there a, um, is there a, um, is there a flamingo emoji? Does that exist? I'm, surely there is, right? Can we put flamingos in the chat? Let's put flamingos in the chat, everybody. There, <laughs> I put flamingos in the chat.
All right, what was I doing? I have no reason to. I have no reason to do that. It makes it sound like I I can give him money, but we don't know why yet. It does. It does. I have to click allow. I just, like, YouTube thinks your guys are spamming, so it's like, no, allow this message. Allow it. There we go. Insert fast looking for an emoji. If you're on computer, I'm on my computer, you can right click in the chat and click on emoji. And then you can search for it there. If you're on your phone, just do it like you normally would. <laughs> Yes! Allow the flamingos! Somehow, the items at the bottom always turn out to be very handy. You know, you got it, you got it. it does. I, I think I need That's these no items, but I don't know how to get the hook to do it. I think I need to turn the necklace into string? I have not. I am not going to waste my time on that crazy shopkeeper. I'll get even with him in the future. Okay, fine. I think I need to use the string from the necklace. Because I have a necklace that you can't see because I'm in the way. There's a necklace and a hook. Should I also just move my, my body? Should we... Hang on. Should I be like... over here would that help <laughs> would that make more sense if i look this way I, my perspective is all it's fine <laughs> i'm over here now <laughs> um i have a hook and i have a necklace and i have a hammer and i have money i feel like i need to use the string but I don't know how to do that. I baked Crazy Dad's favorite cake, especially for the party. I Can I hammer the cake? It doesn't. I don't know why. It doesn't. It. There is a hammer in the cake. It's hammer time, baby. have a lot of options here that I can figure out. It doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't. I don't have. I don't have. I don't have. Why can we say that? Is there something? Balloons. I know there's balloons and I want It doesn't them. work. It doesn't. It doesn't. Is there another place I haven't gone to? No, I've been to all the places. Is there something? There's got to be something else here, maybe. Oh wait, can I hook in the water? It doesn't. It doesn't work. It doesn't. <laughs> I don't have a lot of options. Mo, can you hit the frog with the hammer? Oh, we tried. But no, alas, I cannot. Can I combine items? I can when it lets me. But it's not letting me combine these. Like, normally, like, if I wanted to combine the hook and the necklace, I would just click on one and then click on the other, and that's how you combine. But it's not doing anything. It does what are you planning on doing with this hammer? Me? Nothing at all. A puffy tail. Oh, the tail! Can I do something with the tail? It does. Okay. Smashy, smashy. Okay, it was the tail of the mammoth. I knew there had to be something I could do with the mammoth. I knew there had to be something. I have an eel. Can I take the scissors? I guess it. I, I did. I, I don't know what she said. I accidentally skipped it. But I have a snake and I have schizors. Can I take my amulet back? 
It's a mysterious necklace. And now I can go to the library, skizzer the balloons so that I have balloons. And then I can go to the house and I can hang up my balloons. Balloon problem solved. I'm so smart. I am so smart. Now can I put the snake and the, in the in the hook together to have a snake hook? I'm gonna go downtown, snake hook the vent, and maybe I've got a cassette down there? I've got a cassette of some kind. And then we're gonna go back home, stick it in the cassette player. It's our wedding song. How convenient. Now that we're married, and we're so close, so dear, dear. I pray each night to God to take you Far, far from me. Oh no! That's the wedding song? Oh no! That's it! I have it all! No! The guests are missing! Did we invite anybody? We're, We're here. here! Wait, what? Was it a surprise party? Oh Perfect. god. I think I hear Crazy Dad coming. I I'm pretty sure we don't like most of these people. <laughs> Not even the kids. <laughs> Haven't they all driven Crazy Dad crazy at some point in his games? Surprise! Oh yeah, he's not gonna enjoy this, is he? Surprise party? Why? Oh no. It's not my birthday. Is it your birthday? He's forgotten our anniversary! You forgot? I can't believe it! She's angry and crazy! No! No, no, no! I was joking! Happy Valentine's? Oh no! I'll Valentine you! <laughs> Oh, I'll Valentine you, crazy dad! Come back here! No! I'll teach you a lesson! Help me! I just want to have a talk! <laughs> I like the desperate, help me! That was good! And we saved Christmas, everybody! Happy Easter! It's Valentine's Day! Happy anniversary! <laughs> we did it! We got the party put together. Tune in next week to see if Crazy Mom and Crazy Dad split up. <laughs> Woo! We did it, everybody. That took a minute. That took a hot minute. Riddle school riddle transfer moment. Oh, which one was? Smashy, smashy. That solution was crazy, wasn't it? It sure was. Help me. Help. Help. Help me. That was my favorite. We got one more to do tonight. We got one more. I'll just stay over here since the items are usually in the, in the corner. Now's a good opportunity that if you haven't hit that like button, <laughs> now's a good time to do just that. Benefits include being cool. As I get the game set up once again. We got one more game in us for Carmel Games tonight. There we go. The real school and real transfer moment is from me saying that when Derica said, can you combine items? Oh, I don't re As if I remember that. Kaboom! I couldn't spill my coffee. I, did, I couldn't, you couldn't, you couldn't kaboom the coffee out of my hands. You tried. Insert use minigun to delete the like button. No! But the algorithm! No! Oh, we got a chair in the chat. Before we start this next one, everybody take a moment to say hi to the chair. Hey chair, how you doing? Glad you could be here, always are. Dependable as always. Took a moment to say hi to your chairs as well. And 
appreciate all that it does for your butt. I'm gonna set you back down now. <laughs> Rip algorithm. You've played that jamming with grandma one and I couldn't pass it for the life of me, I don't know why. Does that mean it's gonna be hard? Is it gonna be difficult and I'm gonna be stuck on it forever? Let's find out. Hello friends and welcome to Let's Play Jamming with Grandma. I'm your host Magic Man Mo, and this is the next on my list of Carmel Games games that I haven't played before. But now, we're gonna. <laughs> we're gonna up the volume a little bit. And hit the old play button. Caitlin dear, it's so good to see you. I need your help. There's a jam contest in the senior center I attend and I need your help to get the ingredients. A jam contest? Well, that's just the type of contest I know nothing about. I don't know the first thing about making jam. I won the contest three years in a row, and I want to win again. But Tabitha oh. says she's going to win this year, no matter what. She that said Tabitha. her son has a brilliant plan to win. Oh, that Tabitha and her son, they're going to cheat. I just know it. For my special pear jam, I'll need oh. pears, sugar, a lemon, and vanilla. Unfortunately, I forgot where I placed my money to buy the ingredients. I've never had pear jam before. That sounds like it could be quite refreshing, actually. Why do you, all your other jams have cobwebs on them? Don't worry, Grandma. I'll get it and buy all the ingredients. Don't worry, Grandma. I'm going to get some money somehow. I'm gonna steal it. Yeah, your jams have cobwebs on them. Those old jams have been there as long as I can remember. I don't think Grandma placed them there for eating. Oh, are those her, like, contest winning jams? That's right, dear. Those jams are placed in that order to help me remember something. But I don't remember what. Oh, green, red, purple. All right. These are strawberry jam jars. Ooh, just the jars, though? These are strawberry. Do they have any jam in them? Also, your mouth doesn't move when you talk. These are strawberry jam jars. She's communicating with us telepathically with her demon powers. What's up, Grandma? What's up? Okay, Lindia. We will have time to catch up later. Right now, it is very important that you bring me all the ingredients I need. Pure pears, sugar, vanilla, and a lemon. That's not going to help me make a coconut milkshake. Who do you think you are? Oh, can I open this? Oh, what do we got in here? Mmm, cookies. What is that? Oreos? I've got a couple of Oreos out of the uh, oven. Can I play the piano? Oh, God, I don't know the piano. Oh, no. We've got some symbols up here. So, hopefully... Those are the same. Okay, those are the same as well. I don't know. I don't know what to do with this yet. But okay, I don't know the piano, so we'll see if we can uh, figure that one out later, maybe. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what it is yet. Let's leave and come back. I want to like figure Hello, it out. little girl. Why don't you come with me, and I'll help you get the ingredients for your grandma's jam. Stranger danger! <laughs> Stranger danger! No, I need an adult! How do you know we're making jam? Who are you, anyway? I think I better call my grandma. Don't talk to him! Go back inside! Not safe! Not safe! Oh, no, you don't. He's gonna literally kidnap us! <laughs> You're coming with me. There is no way your grandma is going to win the jam contest again. My mother deserves a chance, too. I wasn't expecting this to take such a turn. Go ahead, spill it. I want to know your grandma's secret jam recipe. What? <laughs> We're literally being kidnapped, okay? I told you a million times. I don't know. Okay, okay. Fine. Have it your way. There's a bomb in this room. It will explode in three hours. All right. If you wish to speed things up, <laughs> just press the red button. <laughs> if you would like to die sooner, little girl, press the red button. What is this game? 
I'm out of here. Ta-ta. <laughs> what? Okay. All right. Okay. <laughs> I didn't realize we were gonna get into a James Bondian situation where we're kidnapped by an evil villain. Oh my god. Why three hours? It's a good question. That's a very good question. I don't know. <laughs> Can I press the red button? Here goes nothing. Oh god! <laughs> oh. Was it a bluff or was he just an idiot? It's not a real bomb. It's just red painted rolls of toilet paper and strings. Oh, whew. oh well, thank goodness this guy was just an, just. I don't even know what he is, honestly. I don't know if he's just dumb. I don't know if he's just enthusiastic. Can I take it with me? There's some sugar in here. Oh, there's a safe it's back locked. here. I need a key to open it. I don't have a key. Oh my god. I real I really thought that this game was just about to really take that turn. Like just just all out like yeah, yeah, your life is in it's not critical a real danger. Sugar factory warehouse. All right. I don't know where we are. Have you seen an evil man with a black hat and cape? Yeah, Freddy Krueger boy junior. Nope. I just got here. Yeah. Oh, what's with the costume? I like the hat. I'm waiting for my friend to come. We want to prank people and film it for our YouTube channel. <laughs> it's just a prank, bro. Good luck. All right, yeah, yeah, good luck. Oh, only losers have YouTube channels. Just a bunch of freaking nerds. <laughs> <laughs> I can see something down there. I can't get down there. Can I, I can go inside, is this the grocery store? But I want cookies. Bring me cookies. <laughs> Bring me cookies. Is this guy a, a straight up elf? Is this guy on the counter a straight up elf? I already told you, sir. We're all out of cookies. I can call you once we have some. Oh my god, does the guy, does the old guy think he's a Keebler's elf? You know Keebler's cookies with the three elves? <laughs> Is that why he's asking him for cookies? Because he thinks he's a Keebler's elf? No, I'm not leaving until you bring me cookies. Fine, so stay there. He's like, I don't care. That's exactly what I said. I've got cookies. Excuse me, sir. I have cookies my grandma baked. Would you like to have them? I think they're Oreos. I don't think she bakes them. Hmm, it's not my favorite brand, but okay, I'll take them. You can have my lizard in return. Thanks, old man, for your lizard that you just keep with you. I'll keep on waiting for my favorite cookie brand to arrive. It will be tomorrow. I'm not moving an inch. But he looks happy about it. <laughs> he looks pretty happy about it. Are we sure he's not moving because he wants cookies? Or is he not moving because he's forgotten how? Hello, do you sell pears? I don't have any money. I have a lizard. Yes, we do. You can find them to your right. Okay. Thanks. Thank you. I have nothing to say to him. Excellent. I don't have money to buy it. That is a good valid point. Yep, that is that is accurate. I don't have money. Let me come back once I have money. <laughs> Only nerds have YouTube channels. Freaking nerds. Just awkward laugh. <laughs> Let's go this way. Mrs. Farrell, oh. may I have a lollipop? Lollipop, lollipop. Ooh, lolly, 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 lollipop. Uh, yeah, I, have a, I have a hard time getting the, the pop sound. No. You stay here while we wait for the garbage man to arrive. Now that your parents are away, I can finally get rid of this lemon tree. But mom said you should give me a lollipop after lunch. Well, your mom's not here, and I'm in charge. Now shut up, or I'll ask the garbage man to pick you up, too. Oh, that's rude. What's up, Dan? Hey, Dan. I'm stuck here with my crazy babysitter again. Here, let my grandma babysit you. Just go inside my house and just ditch this old hag. 
Don't talk to that ugly girl. Who are you calling ugly, madam? And just stupid red hair. She's evil. I can feel it. You're evil. I'm gonna pop you in the schnoz. Do you like lizards? I don't think she'd want that. That's actually exactly my point. I want her to be like, ah, lizard, ah, and then go running away. I don't think he. Fine. May I please take one lemon off your tree? No. You're literally throwing it away, though. But you're throwing the tree away anyway. Yeah. It's yeah. inside your trash can. That is because I hate this tree. I'm waiting for the garbage man to pick it up. Can I have a lemon then? So perhaps may I have one lemon? No! I don't like you. You're mean and stupid. All right, where can I go? What can I do? Can I give grandma a lizard? I don't think she'd want that. Can we make some lizard cookies? No, let's keep going. Oh, I'm back here. Okay, so I don't have a lot of places I can go to. I don't to. think he'd want all right, uh, I do need sugar. I, I don't know why I can't take any sugar. It doesn't work. And I don't have a key, and I don't have money. All right, so we're, I don't have, <laughs> can I send the lizard down here? Oh, I can, with his tail! Oh, okay, all right, I can use the lizard tail to get the key to the safe. And it's got a flower? Oh, it's got vanilla. I'm in a sugar factory, I need sugar. And I got vanilla. Can I pick up this sugar? Mm, oh, there we go. A crate filled with sugar. I'll take some. I needed to click on this specific pile. All right, all right, it checks out, it checks out. I almost missed that. All right, cool. Uh, I still need pears though. Can I talk to grandma? What's up, grandma? Okay, Lindia. We will have time to catch up later. Right now, it is very... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got your vanilla. Grandma, I have vanilla. Oh, bless you, dear. And I got your sugar. Grandma, I have sugar. Oh, bless you, dear. But now what? Slab that old bee. I'll slab that old bee. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what right now. May I please? No. This is Mrs. Farrell. She babysits Dan while his parents are at work. What's up? I'm stuck. Don't. She <sighs> what do I do? What can I do? I think we need to figure out the piano puzzle. Those old Does this is green the green red purple somehow related to all this? All of the notes are red. There's a star here. I don't know why. match does that matter in some way I don't know what I'm doing with this though yeah pears and lemons is all I need I know where they're at I need money for the pears, and I need to get rid of Miss Farrell for the lemon. I just don't know how to do those things. <sighs> Looking around the city for the code. for exactly oopsie I clicked off the game ah, there it is 
Have you seen an evil man with a black hat and cape? Nope, I just got- Oh, what's with the costume? I'm waiting for my friend to- Good luck! Is there anywhere else I can go? Like to the right? No. Hello, do you- s Yes, thank. I have nothing to say to him. I don't have money to- I think the money's in the piano. That's what I think. I think we need to get into the piano for the money. I wonder if his friend is Dan. And the bus is what brings me back and forth between these two locations. I think these are the only two locations. I mean, besides like the grocery store and the warehouse and grandma's house. But I think those are the only two outside locations. Well, you know, I, I get it. I Green, red, purple, but I don't... What does that mean? Those old jams have been there as long- That's right, dear. Those jams are placed in that order to help me remember something. But I don't remember what. Oh, frick. Oh, there's a thing right here. Oh, I didn't even see this. There's a thing- <laughs> There's a thing right here. There's a safe right here. Okay, okay. That- is helpful. Alright, well the star is that. So presumably it needs to start there or maybe even end there. But I think it starts there. Because then that would give me three spaces for the green, the red, and the purple. So what if you go like... left maybe like green like g, g r e e n which is the three and then to the right red r e d which is a one and then purple p u r p no p u r p l where was it p u r p l i can't quite fit purple Unless it's some other color. Unless it can, unless you can wrap around the sides or something. What 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 do the colors mean? they're not in the right order maybe I go right to left because then I from here I can go P U R P L E and then like R E D for red maybe and then green B G R E E N one two one I think this is not the correct combination. I didn't think it would be either. I thought that was a stretch. Grandma, what the frick convoluted nonsense have you have you created here? Right? This is confused. I don't know what this means. I assume it starts with this. That's what I'm basing my assumption off of right now. But maybe it doesn't? Maybe it's just, what if it just starts from the left? 
So like two, and then red is like R E D, which is then three, and then purple is D U R P L E. So like two, three, one. I think this is not the correct combination. I'm trying to think if it's not jars as the code, then what else could it be like? Uh, the, is there a living room in that house that you can go in or grab something? No, there's no other way. Oh, there is another room. What the frick? There is another room. You're right. There's a whole other room. <laughs> okay, all right. An abstract painting. Uh, this a game lovely painting of a lighthouse. Just keeps adding more stuff. An abstract. Oh, well, here's our colors. It's missing a color, though. Let me come back to that. Oh, the bed, though. The bed's got those colors. This is not a good time to jump on the bed. I need to help Grandma first. Well, it's like literally like salmon green. I'm gonna call that blue in this gray. Why not? Oh. So we got that, that salmon color, the like green color, that like blue color, and then that like kind of grayer blue color. Oh, that was easy. That was easy peasy. I've got eight equals star four eight two two. Okay. All right. That's something. That's something. All right. This is this is the jams. Green, red, purple. Okay. Green, red, sorry, purple. Easy peasy, lollipop, lollipop, ooh, lolly, 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 lollipop. Ba dum bum bum. This is. Okay, there's a whole other freaking room over here. I was losing my god dang mind. I was losing my god dang eh, mind. Four, eight, two, two. So if the star is eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep, that checks out. So four is one, two, three, four is that. Oh, that's the same thing as this. And then two, two is just, okay, easy. Turn it. There we go. Ah, and I've got a key, which I assume goes into the abstract painting. And now I've got money. Oh, the, okay, now we're good. Oh, we're golden. Oh, we're golden. Here, have a lollipop. I heard you want a lollipop, so you can have mine. There you go, buddy. Thanks, Caitlin. You're the best. Oh, I know, I know. I am the best. I'm not evil like that woman over there says I am. Where did you get this lollipop? Don't run away. Come back here. <laughs> I'll get you. We have a comic book action scene. Also, I love that. I'll get you. What was his name? Dan? I'll get you, Dan. Oh, they're gone. I'm going to take a lemon. And we're going to ask a the frickin' pear. I want to buy these pears. Here's the money. Thanks. Come again. Bye, elf man. There we go. Now we have all of our ingredients. Grandma, I have a lemon. When life gives you lemons, give them to Grandma. Oh, bless you, dear. I didn't sneeze. Grandma, I have pears. Oh, dear. I need peeled pears, not unpeeled pears. Oh, do I need to peel these? Okay, where is the knife? Heavens no. A child at your age holding a knife? No siree, Bob. I don't see what the problem is, Grandma. What do you think I'm gonna do with a knife? Then what am I supposed to do? You're a smart girl. I'm sure you'll find a way. I gotta find a way to peel this pear. I think I've got just the ticket. Oh wait, it's that guy out here with the with the scissors. Are those hands. real blades on your glove? Yeah, are those real. Are those real blades? They sure are. That seems dangerous, but could you do me a favor? Can you peel those pears for me, please? Okay, I have nothing better to do. I mean, you could have been a little bit more like suave about that. Like, yes, of course. For you, I would do anything. Here you go. Thanks. Okay, we got um, a peeled pear now. There you go, Grandma. Grandma, I have peeled pears. Oh, bless you, dear. Achoo! I have all the ingredients. Thank you, dear. We're doing it. Oh, Kesuara, welcome to the strap. 
I hope I said that right. I probably didn't, and I apologize. Don't become your sleep paralysis demon again. Whatever do you mean? <laughs> Dos horas después. That's it. My pear jam is ready. Pear jam. Great. Let's have a taste. <laughs> I want to taste some pear jam. Are you nuts? I'm diabetic. This stuff will kill me. Oh, well, that's really unfortunate, but that's more for me. Now that Grandma is at the contest, I can finally find out what her secret recipe is. <laughs> 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Standing ovation. Best game. Best carvel game. Got kidnapped. Threatened to be exploded. I was given a button to murder myself with. It didn't do that, but that's what he said it would do. The jam had fake snakes in it. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. I, I, I can't. I can't even. Best. Best one. Best one so far. Definitely best one of the night. Oh my god. <laughs> we did it. We made the pear jam and saved Christmas. Or the day, or whatever. I don't know why. I, I, Amazing. 10 out of 10. Can't top that today. Certainly not today. Oh my god, that was good. <laughs> I like that it was like an action cutscene, too. It was beautiful. Beautiful. Oh my god. Be careful about showing that knife. Hey, Jessica, welcome to the stream. Why? What's wrong with me showing my knife? It's just a kitchen knife. There's lots of kitchen cooking shows on YouTube. What's wrong with my giant kitchen, kitchen, kitchen knife? What, what's the, what's wrong with that? <laughs> I don't know what the problem could be. You actually said that perfectly. It's been a very long time since I dropped by. Hog call me uh, Cass if that's easier. It probably is. It's a single syllable, nice, easy, simple. <laughs> it's like, uh, mine is Mo, so, you know. No, no, Grandma, you forgot to put poison in the red one. Don't worry, there was no red one. Jar of Snakes is the secret to Graham Graham's pear jam recipe. That was actually the strawberry jam. When we clicked on it, um, um, what was our name? Caitlin. Caitlin was like, oh, strawberry jam jars. She didn't even say it was strawberry jam. She actually explicitly said strawberry jam jars. So actually, we were foreshadowed that there was no jam in them. That's like so clever. 10 out of 10. It's not even April Fool's yet. Could you imagine if I'd streamed this on April Fool's? That would have been amazing. April 1st uh, is your brother's birthday. Is it really? Happy early birthday. Can I peel these pears? I sure can! <laughs> I think YouTube flagged your comment there for a second because it has the word knife in it, but I got you. Don't trust a man in a fedora with a kitchen knife. Uh, yep, yeah, that's probably fair. You know what, that's, I, I think you can trust me, but maybe that's fair. You know what, in general, maybe that's a fair, <laughs> fair statement. If, you, if you're in a dark alley, you see a man with a fedora and a knife. Maybe don't trust him. I'm not saying it'll be me. I'm totally cool. Oh my god. I heard people have been getting kicked from YouTube and stuff for weapons. Look, I'm a trained knife professional, and you should treat knives with respect and not wave them around to hurt yourself. That, I'm a trained professional on YouTube. There's no way this could possibly get anyone hurt. Don't even worry about it. <laughs> it's a fake knife, see? Didn't even do anything. <laughs> um, for legal reasons, do not brandish knives ever and hurt yourself. There you go, that's my disclaimer. I am an adult. I uh, work in a kitchen for a living. <laughs> I am not condoning any of you to go running around brandishing knives. 
If that needs to be said, there you go. I've said it. There you go. There you go. Hey! Cass, thank you so much for the membership! I'm so glad you enjoyed the stream. Thank you so much. Your support goes to help this channel become bigger and better one day. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Holy cow. I should brandish knives more often. No. <laughs> You're right, but you're right, Jessica. I'm not making fun of you. You're right. Uh, the display of weapons, which this is not, not a weapon knife. This is literally a kitchen knife. It's a kitchen knife, so it's not for harm of any kind. It's not a weapon. But you're right. You're right. <laughs> I should not be so irresponsible with it. You're right. You're not wrong. I'm just joking around. been playing Carmel games on the good old Flashpoint player and they've been a blast. I've actually been playing the Carmel games um, from Congregate. Are you, if you're aware of congregate.com, um, they have their own Flash player, which this might be what you're talking about. They have their own Flash player um, in their website built in so I can play those games. Any games that Congregate still has, I can play them there. So I've been playing the Carmel games from there. When we played the Inca game stuff, um, I had to do it with like uh, with Flashpoint. By Blue, by Blue, what's the name of the company? Blue Maxima, whatever it is. I was using Flashpoint for that. But on Congregate, I can play the Carmel games just off the website. That's just easier. But yeah, that's what I've been doing. I saw you made an Instagram account. Oh, I've had an Instagram account for a while, for a long while. I just barely ever used it. Um, and it's it's not a Magic Man Mo Instagram account. It's just my Instagram account, but uh, for the last several weeks now, I've just been uploading basically like my shorts, my YouTube shorts and t TikToks and stuff to my Instagram. So yeah, I have an Instagram, and if you're interested in that, uh, give it a follow. I think there's a link in the description to my Instagram somewhere. Probably. <laughs> This is already using that emoji. Mo, I may get membership today. I've been planning it for months. Well, if you do, then of course, thank you very much as well. No hurry, of course. If you've been planning it, if, if you need to like save money or whatever, you don't have to do that. You don't have to. Totally cool if you don't. Up to you entirely. It's been a pleasure watching your streams. Well, thank you. It was a pleasure having you. I know I haven't seen you in the chat lately, but I also know a lot of folks uh, that have been with the channel for a long time sometimes like lurk in the stream. So sometimes I don't know when people are watching, but just not chatting. So you never, you never know. You never know who's watching and when. That's why even on the streams when there's not a lot of people talking, I still do my best to like, still do a good show for everyone that's watching. Because you never know. You never know who's watching in general, <laughs> in life. You don't know when you're being watched. <laughs> if $280 or something because of my birthday on March 24th, well, happy belated birthday. I don't remember if I wished you happy birthday or not. I don't know if I streamed on the 24th. What was the 24th? Last Thursday? Did I stream last Thursday? I kind of think I didn't. But anyway, happy belated birthday. If I didn't say so already, I can't remember. I've wished a few people happy birthday in the last month or two, and I don't remember who all it was, because I'm not very good at remembering dates. You're still here? Hi. Welcome to the post show. We're just chatting and hanging out. The Ray and Cooper series, and I believe there's one, this long, what, there's this one long intensive murder mall, one by Carmel Games, can't remember too well. Uh, Ray and Cooper, I think we did one of theirs. Is there more than one? I don't remember. But I still have... I don't have it open. I don't have my list open. But the Murder Mall one, I actually have already played. I did, um, videos of those. I didn't stream them. Murder Mall was the one that was mobile, right? That was the one that was like a mobile game. Because they were trying to do, I think they were going to try to do mobile games because Flash was dying, obviously. So I think they were trying to move into doing mobile games. 
and they released that one and i don't know if it just didn't do super duper well and they ended up having to like because the, the caramel games doesn't make anything anymore yeah ray and cooper yeah there's ray and cooper and ray and cooper 2 that's right yeah, I remember that. Yeah, I remember. I, I couldn't remember. I was like, Ray and Cooper sounds familiar, but I couldn't remember what the game was. I just looked it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember that. Because the second one is when they went missing, and you had to get them from the, uh, the occult people or whatever. I remember that now. Okay, that's right. I couldn't remember what Ray and Cooper was. But I think the Murder Mall was a mobile game. I made videos of those. Got to tell me. Okay, well, then my statement stands. Oh, I'm glad, Tyler. I'm glad my streams can brighten your day. That is kind of part of why I do it a little bit, you know? Kind of, at the very least, if it's not why I do it, it's like my goal when I am doing it. You know what I mean? Like, ob the objective <laughs> is a good time to have fun and brighten people's day. You know what I mean? So, I hope it works. I don't know, I'm playing with my microphone now. I need to find a good place. I want it to be slightly, I want it here, but like I can't get stay there. I'm still working on it. I've moved my microphone slightly so it's not like right up against my face. But now it's like got this weird kind of floating. I gotta keep working on it. I'll keep playing with it. It's not that important. Sorry, I got distracted. If I talk and then disappear without saying bye or anything, I'm usually just lurking. I'm the same way when I'm watching another streamer or something, which I don't do very often, but when I do, I might say hi or something and then just like, like just lurk the entire time. I'm a lurker. I like to lurk. Sometimes I don't, if I'm watching a stream, sometimes I never say anything at all. I just have it on, usually in the background while I'm doing something else, usually editing videos. If I'm watching a stream, it's usually on in the background while I'm editing. So that's, I just lurk. I'm a lurker. You would never know if I was watching a stream. You'd be like, is Magic Man Mo here? You'd never know. <laughs> There's quite a few games uh, for Ray and Cooper. Is there three of them? I think I've only played two of them. I see one, I see two Ray and Cooper. That, or if there's a third one, maybe it's not, it didn't make it to Congregate, and maybe I just don't know about it. That is possible. Ray and Cooper, there's Creepo's Tale. Awesome. There's the David and Keithan one, obviously. I'm going through my list. Marcella, Dakota, Gatekeeper. There's Jamming with Grandma. So if there is a third one, we haven't gotten to it yet on my list. Vortex Point. We've done the Vortex Points. Those were fun. The Vortex Points were a good series. Save the Clock, Carlo, something. I'm only seeing two Ray and Coopers, unless I missed it, or unless it's not on Congregate, which is possible. I just end up watching your entire Carmel game, <laughs> so it's a bit rusty for me to remember which ones that haven't been already played. Yeah, same, same, same for me, because when I started playing them, I wasn't sure that I was gonna commit to playing all of them. So I played like a, a, just a couple of them, like the more recent ones or whatever. And especially at the time, I think I did, what was the first one I did? The first one I did, I think might've been Faraday's Flaw, or maybe it was Madhead. I think it was, I think it was Faraday's Flaw. It was the, literally the first one I did. And it was like, one of like their newest game at the time when I did it so it did really well for views or whatever I'm like okay I'll do a few more of these and then more and more people kind of started trickling in like oh carnival games I grew up with those games you know that kind of thing um I never did I had never heard of them someone I forget who 
I forget how I learned about Carmel Games. Someone had suggested it to me because I do the Inca game stuff and it's point and click adventure games on the on the web. And someone was like, well, um, I like Carmel Games. They're point and click adventure games on the web too. And I'm like, okay, I'll check it out. And I eventually did. I don't remember who suggested that first. I don't remember now. And I don't remember if it was uh, in a stream or if it was probably a comment on a video somewhere. I don't remember. But yeah, that's how I discovered that. I had never played these games or heard of them. And then... I just started doing all of them. I've got a ghost microphone. Ooh, ghost microphone. Sorry if this has already been answered, but have you ever tried going for streaming on Twitch, or is YouTube more of a comfortable place? Um, I occasionally uh, still stream to Twitch randomly for like games that I don't think would like work on this channel on YouTube. So um, sometimes on a Sunday morning, if I don't have to work, which I had to last Sunday, and I have to work again next Sunday. So no, no Twitch stream last Sunday or this coming Sunday. But every now and again on a Sunday morning, I still stream to Twitch, just some random game. It's a lot more chill or, or low key or whatever, because I'm just, Twitch isn't my place. But for a long time, I say for a long time, it was probably like a year or so, I was streaming, um, was it? it was like most mornings it was like uh, th somewhere between three and five mornings a week I was streaming to twitch like every morning uh, before I like go I, I would go to work because of my work schedule was more like in the middle of the day somewhere like a 10 or 11 or whatever in the morning and then uh, I would work but no 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 this was back when oh no no this was when I was working evenings I think I was working like three o'clock in the afternoon or something and working till like 10 or 11 in the evening so I was streaming to Twitch in the morning from like 7 to 10 or whatever it was, 7 to 11, to 8 to 10, 8 to 11, so just in the morning. I stream like every morning, almost every morning. And then when I'd get off like work, I would come home and I would stream in the evening to YouTube from like 11 to 2 in the morning or something, 11.30 to 2, 1.30 or something like that. Oh, I forgot about that. So I used to do a lot more uh, Twitch. I, I got most of all my followers that I have on Twitch from back when um, Getting Over It with Bennett Foddy and um, Doki Doki Literature Club, when those were popular. I did those on Twitch, and that's like where all my followers came from. I have like not even 300 or whatever. So, But my home will always be YouTube. YouTube is where I started. I started making videos on YouTube in 2012. And I, I was a video maker, I did videos, I wasn't a streamer, and I did videos for a long time. This is where, still where like the bulk of my audience is, YouTube feels more like home than Twitch does. I think Twitch has some cool things going on that I think is neat, but um, I, I never found my footing on Twitch. I just, I kind of prefer YouTube myself. Your plays are back on Zoom. That's so disappointing. A lot of us are kind of getting out of, like, is it because of, like, COVID or whatever? A lot of places are getting out of that now, kind of moving on from it. But I guess not everywhere. I'm out. I went to go drink and I'm out. I'm all out of my coffee. Your nose keeps getting blocked, do you have a cold? Because what it often is, if you like blow your nose a lot, and like very little or nothing's coming out, but you still feel clogged, it's because your sinuses are actually swelling. So and when your sinuses swell in your nose, it feels like your nose is blocked. So when you blow your nose, like nothing comes out or you can't get anything to come out because there isn't anything there blocking it. It's your sinuses being swelled from the constant blowing of your nose or swelling from like having a cold or whatever. That kills me. I hate it when I have sinus swelling from having a cold so I feel like I need to blow my nose but there's nothing to blow out of my nose there's nothing there it's so frustrating I hate that I came from a, trying to find a tutorial for Trump saw game and I couldn't figure it out and I stumbled across you is that how you found my channel Evan I don't remember how everybody found my channel but that's hilarious uh. So a lot of people found me uh, from Inca Games, uh, trying to people trying to find tutorials 
on Inca Games, which I don't make tutorials for them, I do Let's Plays, but still, like, if you stumble upon my channel that way, a lot of people did. Actually, one of my, one, one comment that I still think about sometimes was someone on an early Inca Games video, um, commented that my, my videos would be better if I didn't talk in them. This was years ago, and and it was on an Inca game video, and I, I'm like, I don't know if they're trying to insult my voice, like they don't like the sound of my voice, which, fair enough, whatever. Um, especially back then, I talked differently, because um, I wasn't used to doing YouTube yet. So like, were they insulting my voice because they didn't like my voice? Fair enough. Or were, did they think I was making a tutorial and my commentary wasn't helpful, so I should just stop. You know what I mean? But I was like, I'm not doing a tutorial, it's a let's play, so you're supposed to talk. But then, you know, there's other channels like on YouTube for uh, Inca Games uh, tutorials. Like uh, the, uh, the, what's it called? The Inca Gamer. I think every time there's a new Inca game, they, they do a, a, a walkthrough on their channel. Um, that's one that I know comes up if you try to search Inca Games. Inca Gamer, and I think there's there might be another one that's like, uh, I don't know if it's still around. There was like a point and, there was another point and click walkthrough channel that existed that some Inca Games games were on. So that's for like walkthroughs. But those are some popular ones. But a lot of people found me that way anyway, which I thought was interesting. Joaquin, yeah, welcome, welcome to the end of my stream. We're just chatting and hanging out. I'll be probably ending pretty soon. Yeah, a lot of people found me that way. Yeah, I'm glad you found me as well. Coffee time? Oh, it's always coffee time. Always, always. But I'm, I should be going to bed very soon. I have an early morning. Wednesday mornings are my early morning at work. I have to go in and do like inventory and stuff. No, I don't have a cold. I don't nose. Is that a pun? <laughs> you need to get a new computer camera. I want to get a new camera camera like just a legitimate video camera and hook it up with a cam link and get some better like video quality. But I just have, it's a, it's a decent webcam. It's like the one every freaking YouTuber uses if they use a webcam for their computer. I forget what it's, what model it, it is. It's the Logitech CS something or other. It's the one, it's the one that's like, I wish I could pick it up and show you, but I can't, it doesn't work that way. But um, you know, it's the one that's kind of like wide with the blue lights around the camera. Every friggin' YouTuber uses it. If you're using a webcam, it's, it's hilarious. So Trump Saga was like your first Inca Games game, and then you couldn't figure it out, so you found me. That is hilarious. I'm so sorry. <laughs> you believe it was the latter since they were looking for a tutorial and they were relentlessly trying to find one that worked? And that could be what happened, and I never found out. I tried to ask them. I tried to, I don't remember what I said, but I like replied to their comment like, do you mean this or do you mean that? Never got a reply. The camera doesn't work on Zoom. Are you sure your Zoom settings are correct? You might need to go into your webcam settings in Zoom. I have, to this day, still never used Zoom, so I have no idea how Zoom even works. <laughs> You were one of the first couple videos that showed up when looking it up. Also, I don't usually sub to tutorial channels, but Let's Plays are fun, so I subbed because you made me laugh a lot in one video. Well, thank you. And yeah, thank you. You're welcome, but thank you. I, I don't usually subscribe to tutorial channels either because you usually look for like a solution to a thing and then moving on with your life. But. Mo's weakness is jokes. I do enjoy a good joke. I don't know if it's a weakness or not. 
You have a wonderful personality. Mo never changed that. Well, thank you. Oh, you flatter, you flatter me. You flatter me. Thank you. Thank you. I have to dab my eyes. Yep, 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 yep. <laughs> I don't have any tissues on me. These are, um, these are actually mask filters that I put in my COVID mask. I don't know why they're on my desk. I think I think they fell out of my mask and I put them on my desk and put them back in and I forgot. They're little filters. <laughs> in case you're like, does he really just have everything at his desk? I'm like, <laughs> Zoom is a nightmare. I, I've still never used it. I'm trying to go through my life without ever having used Zoom. <laughs> You've had this computer for 11 years. That is an old computer. My computer's never survived that long. Shark. Shark is my weakness. Shark is terrible. Another reason I sub is because you stick to similar things like games and stuff, but you don't stick to a single game for multiple videos. I try not to. I'm kind of a mixed bag. I try to think of games that are vaguely similar to each other, but like I'm I'm kind I'm a little bit all over the place. I'm a little bit all over the place. But I, I do understand like some games, like I know when I go into certain games, like, okay, this is gonna work better than that, and whatever. But I still kind of experiment from time to time, but I'm also not like a one trick pony. Like I'm not like just doing, like, you know, I don't like just do like Fortnite or I don't just do like the Roblox or you know, that kind of thing. Like I haven't done Roblox in a while. Or like uh, when I, I did like 50 episodes of that Looney Tunes World of Mayhem a lot of episodes of that but it's not like the only thing i do i don't only do inca games i don't only do combo games so, like i try to still mix it up for sure it's 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 not just for the chant like not just for like content sake it's also for my own sanity if i play the same thing over and over again i start to kind of lose it a little bit like even inca games love inca games love what they're doing i've met aldo we have some kind of relationship a little bit there, but I can't just play Inca games straight. I go, I go a little, I go a little crazy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Your videos are sometimes expressed, and we don't always know what you're gonna do. I like it when people ask me, are you gonna do this? And I'm like, I don't know, maybe. I also don't know what I'm going to do. <laughs> the Area 51 Roblox stream, you were there? <laughs> I do not remember the Area 51. We did an Area 51 stream. I don't remember it. Was it the one where you had to like um, fight all of the, uh, uh, it was like kill the killers or kill the murderers or whatever like Slenderman and Jeff the Killer and all of them were in it in an underground bunker in a desert or something is that what you're thinking of or it was it something else I don't remember it Area 51 Roblox I believe it I just don't remember it I might have to look it up someone with a magical beard and a fedora with a Hawaiian t-shirt play my favorite type of genre OG games the, the look has stuck. I have gone through a number of different looks. The, my name was always Magic Man Mo. I never changed my name. But that's been my name since before I did YouTube. Um, I started making videos in 2012, but I made my YouTube account in 2009. It has been Magic Man Mo ever since. So that's always been the thing, but my look has changed several times throughout the years. And this is the one that stuck, apparently. Uh, uh. I like I like having a like a costume for YouTube so that it's like um, you know like a uniform as it were something like kind of this similar I've changed which Hawaiian shirt I've changed which fedora over time a little bit but I like the idea of like having that sort of consistency I just I like having a consistency like that zoom is so laggy oh my god bruh Kill the Killers in Area 51. Is that what it's called? Kill the Killers in Area 51? Then I do know what you're talking about. I guess I just forgot that it was supposed to be Area 51. I guess that's what it was. I have a restaurant in my town called Area 57. 
What kind of food do they sell? Fits with my Magic Minimo intros. Well, yeah, because I kind of developed... Because, again, the intros were for consistency as well. I wanted an intro, which I don't do intros anymore. Other than, like, when I do the hello and welcome to Let's Play Blah Blah Blah, I'm your host, Magic Man Mo. Other than, like, saying it, I don't really do video intros anymore. Um, just because. I, I could make them again. If I did, I want to make another new one. But in intro videos, like little short few second long intro videos kind of like fell out of popularity on YouTube in general. There's a few channels and stuff that still do it. Like Game Grumps comes to mind, for example. Um, I don't really so much anymore, but I still do like the intro thing a little bit. But I also do more streaming and shorts more than I do videos anymore. I want to make some more video videos eventually, but I have a lot of work I want to do on this channel and my podcast and, and my podcast and stuff like that that I want to do first, and then I'll get to making videos here. I've got a lot of things I'm trying to do, and I, I don't give myself enough time. But I do want to make regular videos here as well eventually. There's going to be a lot of content on this channel. Do I like Plants vs. Zombies? I've never played Plants vs. Zombies. I've never played it. I've had lots of people over the years ask me to play Plants vs. Zombies or ask for my opinion on Plants vs. Zombies, and I've never played it. I probably should. I probably should add that to the list of things I should play on the channel that people might be hype about. Wow, so you've been on YouTube for eight or nine years, but well, actually, I've been, again, I made my account in 2009, so that's been like uh, 13 years that I've had my account. My 10 year anniversary of uploading to YouTube is this June. I forget what day exactly. It's this June. I have a 10 year anniversary coming up this summer. I may or may not be planning something for that. What was your question? I didn't even read it. How much longer do you expect to be on here? I hope you're not leaving anytime soon. I hope not either. I started doing this um, for fun and um, as an escape and for lots of reasons um, that I've, I've mentioned before in other streams. But I started doing this for a lot of reasons and that hasn't changed. In fact, it's only grown. Uh, my reasons for sticking around has only developed and uh, my desire to stick around has only strengthened Especially as more and more of you discover, there's more of you to talk to and enjoy these games, share these games with, and I don't know, it's just become even more fun over the years. And I've gotten, dare I say, dare I toot my own horn a little bit, I've gotten even better at doing it than I used to be, so I like doing it. Breakfast and lunch, it's a cafe. Ooh. I need to find a good cafe. I work in the mornings, but like on mornings I don't work. I need to find a good cafe. There's cafes around me, but I don't ever go. They were irreplaceable for what it was. I should bring it back. What was your childhood show? I don't know what you mean, but the first thing that came to my mind was Code Lyoko. So how about that? <laughs> Code Lyoko, the show that no one's ever heard of. I think it was made by a French studio. It's a weird show, man. Does he play Minecraft? I have played Minecraft. I used to have... I've, I've had a few series of Minecraft. Uh, mine, uh, my, uh, actually, Minecraft was one of the first ever like actual series that I had on the channel a long, long time ago. Uh, the Legend of Cheryl the Sheep lives on in my heart. I don't think those videos are public anymore. I think they're private because they're one of the one of the ones from the 2012 and 2013 era where like all my videos are private because <laughs> they're so bad. But yeah, I've done a lot of Minecraft in the past, but I don't do a lot of Minecraft anymore because honestly, there are so many channels that do Minecraft so much better than me. So much better than me. I don't, I don't thrive in sandbox scenarios. I like playing it on my own, 
but for a show, like to stream or make videos about, I don't really thrive at that. I love Minecraft. I used to play so much Minecraft on my own time, but uh, for making streams and stuff, I I don't like know what to do, <laughs> and I think I'm really boring. Spyro 4 is income. What? Don't you lie to me, Jessica. Spyro 4? What is this? What are you talking about? Spyro 4. Fan game being made in dreams as a new demo. I don't... I'll look into this, but it's a fan game. It's Daddy not a How dare you? How dare you? Get out of here. I'll, I'll, I'll have to look into it because uh, if there's a fan game of Spyro 4, I would probably be curious to play that one because I'm a huge Spyro fan. Um, or at least of the original trilogy. <laughs> I'd be curious to see what that looks like. I had not heard about this. Have I played Raft before? I have not. I know what that game is. I remember when it came out, and I had thought about getting the game at the time, and I never did. I never pulled the trigger. At the time, I had Daddy to make it. How dare you? How dare you? Why? Why do you hate me? Why? No! We're not playing the Pirates game anymore. No more sharks! What was I saying? Oh, yeah, I didn't think my... I'm blurry. I'm blurry face. Um, however that song goes. But um, I wasn't sure if my computer could handle it. At the time, I had an aging computer, and I didn't think I could handle it. Also, it cost money, and at the time, money was pretty was pretty short on money, so I was trying to save money. So I never ended up doing videos or whatever of rap, but I know about that game. I had a buddy, my buddy Logan, who was trying to do a YouTube channel. I have to bring the knife out again? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> um... My buddy Logan was trying to do uh, Let's Plays. He, he gave it a, he gave it a whirl. Um, and I think he did an episode of rap. I think it was Logan. That it was my buddy. Um, I, I had a few buddies trying to do... When did I meet Silencer? I think Raft was before Silencer. Silencer is... I forget the number. 369? I always forget his number. The Silencer might have done it. Or it might have been my other buddy. Um, I'm trying to remember what his YouTube name was. I think it was like... Leo 114 or something like that. His profile pic picture was like a lion. I think that was his YouTube name. I think it was like Leo. Leo 114 or something. He might have done raft. Somebody, one of my buddies, I don't remember which one, did a raft episode and I watched it back in the day. I don't remember who did it. But I never did. Ouch. And that was back when it was still a really basic game. It's developed a lot since then. You got scared by the shark's spell? Nice, bruh. Slava, welcome to the end of the stream. You're one of the sharkers, how dare you? Playing raft sounds fun, should I do raft? You guys you guys think I should do raft, maybe? It ha is now the time that I finally do raft? Have you done a dare video? I don't think so. I did a Reddit 1550 challenge. No! <laughs> I need to end this stream before I get sharked. The shark attack never ends. Bye, buddy. Bye, buddy. You gotta sleep, Heaven. Well, thank you for hanging out. We'll see you next time. Thank you. Easy mode on raft is probably best to just get a feel for raft and just chill. Oh no, we're not doing, we don't do easy mode on these, on, on my streams. We don't do easy. We don't really do hard, we usually do normal, but we don't do easy. We don't do it. If I lose my items, I lose my items. Daddy so be it. No! No! I'm just a hat now. There's no Magic Man Mo, only hat. Only hat stream. From now on, Mo is gone, only hat. <laughs> Can
can next stream be wrapped? I don't know if it'll be next stream, but maybe, maybe we'll get there. Pokemon would be, I can't get up. Pokemon would be fun. I haven't played a Pokemon. I haven't played a Pokemon game since Emerald version on the Game Boy Advance SP. So that was third generation, for those of you that don't know. They're on like generation nine now, or whatever it is, nine, 10? I think, I think they're on Gen 9. There's new Pokemon games coming out later this year. Is that Gen 10, I think? Gen 10. Gen 10. Sounds like Ben 10. What if all the Pokemon in Gen 10 are aliens? Ben 10, Gen 10 crossover? Oh, hi, Hat. <laughs> hi, Mr. Hat. Hi, Dr. Nick. Have I heard of the Will Smith slab thing? Yeah, I, I, I did hear about that. I did, I finally watched the clip. I finally watched the clip of it happening. Um, look, look, something needs to make the um, Oscars. That's what it was, right? Someone needs to make the Oscars interesting. I have no comment on any of that. I, I'm just like, it's just celebrities duking it out. I. They're all absurdly rich, and I'll never be able to relate to them, and they're all just on a show, the Oscars that no one really cares about anymore. <laughs> so whatever, I, not my business. <laughs> but I've seen the memes for sure, so many memes. All right, what time is it? Oh, it's almost 11, I gotta get out of here, guys. I got, I got an early morning. I'm gonna head out of here. But thank you all so much for enjoying the stream with me. It was a blast. Dude, that last game was amazing. Um, if you haven't already, I, I joked about it earlier, but hit that like button. <laughs> it helps YouTube's algorithm share the streams or whatever. Um, and I would appreciate it. You don't have to, but I'd appreciate it. Uh, big shout out to Cass for becoming a member today. Thank you so much. Bye, everybody. If you enjoyed the stream, please do all of the things. But until next time, take care of yourselves, take care of each other, and wash your hands. I'm out of here. Bye.